Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me for this video. Uh, I am sorry it's been a while since I have posted, but I have a lot of new content coming your way. Uh, but today we're going to be looking at the song Meet Us uh, by James Wilson. So let's jump into this tutorial. Um, and this song's in the key of B. Okay, so we're going to be using um, the, the pattern and this song repeats uh, quite a bit. So I'll take this song kind of like bigger sections at a time. But I want to break down a few things for you guys uh, that will help you in this song. So let's get to it. This first part is just kind of like free flowing. With how you we want you in this place. You're the reason why So that first part, I'm breaking down just a few things, but the basic chord structure of this song is uh, we're going to, on the six here. We're, like I said, we're in the key of B, so we're on the six, G sharp minor seven to the four, E, one, B, and then the five is going to be the F sharp. Okay. So a couple things that I really liked. Um, uh, one one thing in the beginning, uh, and I kind of you know you can see like some of the little things I did, but just kind of walking it down from that G sharp minor. And then uh, this chord here I really liked. One pass, um, he did this. You could do kind of, you could actually add that D sharp in or just play it like this. But that G sharp is on top and it gives it kind of a different feel of the chord, okay? Or an E chord, just an E major chord. But you can play all of them too, okay? Make it really, really thick sounding. But I like that sound. And then one, one time we went to the five here, like this suspension. And then uh, playing this, that was nice. Okay, so that is just just a harmony there. Okay, so you start with, no, you start with just there, just that suspension, and then like that. Okay, and then uh, so we lift up our hands to the Father. We're in need of your. And then it changes here to a G sharp in the bass, okay? Not the five, but the seven, which is the five over seven. So the um, the five is F sharp over the seven, which is A sharp, okay? So that's the only thing that kind of changes in that whole uh, thing there. So it's just free flowing there, and then we get into this rhythm. So let's jump to this part. Same thing here. Come on, if you want them in this place, why don't you lift up your hands and worship right now? No one else will do.
thing is the beginning. So before we get into the, the bridge, I want to show you just a couple things. It's the same as the beginning, right? Uh, everything. Who did not move without you? And then we're going to this the seven instead of the uh, just the five. So five over seven here. Okay. Uh, and one thing I forgot to do is on the get to that that B. This part. So that. Da, 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 da. I like that as well. Now all that is is. like that okay and then you're back to uh and then when we start just doing that very common movement there okay then we have the, the tension here stuff like that so throughout the the piano part you're seeing a lot of that stuff okay so then we get into this like um, pre-chorus type thing and that's just the two three and then you to that five suspension and then I did that same thing as we did in the beginning so just that harmony thing and uh, chorus as we lift up our hands to you all that's the same, okay? And you could play that the chord again if you want. One to the, uh, sorry, to the seven there. And then same thing. All on your name, blessed Savior, we're in need of. And then to the five, okay? So you just have to listen for that seven versus that five, okay? And the right hand will be the same. It's the left hand that changes with the bass line, okay? And then we get into this uh, vamp here. So let's jump to that. All right, so right there. So let's take you through that bridge. So it's. Okay, so the chords are the same. You have the six, four, one, and then this is the seven. Right hand is doing this melody. Okay, so it's these notes here. So you start with that F sharp. Okay, so if you use just four fingers on it, it makes it really easy because you just you don't have to really think about it. And then you just kind of build and it just keeps going. So six, four, one, flat seven. I mean not flat seven, but uh seven. So okay. And then um and then you get into kind of this built bridge. And this one has a few changes uh where the bass line changes. I'll kind of point those out, but I'll play through like the whole thing and point out some of the changes that happen in that. All right, let's get to it. in this part. Six, four, one. Seven. That's 
a free pull right there. Down three, one, seven, three, four again. Just interlude. Same chords here. All right, so that bridge, it's all the same. Uh, so just that six, four, one, and then either the seven or the five. Okay, and then we did the three, four. I'll just show you the three. Uh, what I'm doing on the three is just a B over a D sharp, okay? So B chord in my right hand, D sharp, and then to that E, okay? And one, five, and that's the only difference there. And then on the interlude, they're just kind of, we're just like hitting these notes. So just six, four, just all together as a band, just rocking and build, build, five, cut. So we enter, and then we're back to this last chorus. So let's jump to the last chorus and to the ending of the song. Same chorus as before. Five this time. Three, four, right there. Here comes the flip right here. All right, so before we take it to this outro, let me take you through that part, that, that crazy little uh, part. So we're on this chorus. Uh, meet us with your love, meet us with your grace. Let the supernatural happen in this place. When your glory falls, three, four, never. So meet us, and then right here, meet us, and we do. Uh, so I'm doing a diminished chord, okay? Just breaking down the notes of, the, of G diminished. And ending on that G. I'm doing an octave. Uh, those melody lines so meet us with your love okay, and I'm doing it with octaves on top here but splitting it an octave to the bottom so again that, those chords meet us okay so that and meet us with your love three Okay, then this rest is the same. Let the supernatural happen in this place. Then your glory falls. Three, four, and never be the same. Meet us, and then five, meet us. And then we get to the outro. And one other thing I'll point out is that I, I do play a lot of like left-hand chords here. I try to stay away from the bass line as much as possible. So you, you just don't want to like, if you have a bass player, you don't want to be playing your left hand in octaves like real low here. So I try to like, meet us, uh, meet us with your love. Meet us with your my left hand's playing an E chord, left hand playing a B chord. Natural happen in this place. So when your glory falls, will never be the same. 
same. So I'm trying to stay away from this low, low end uh, just to give room for the bass player. So just a side note there. So let's jump to the outro here and we'll be done with this song. All right, so then we go that transition to another song there, but that's the ending. So the chord is still the same, six four one five or six four one uh, seven. So this whole song is the same progression. Uh, so it's just a matter of ch kind of changing uh, like some of the voicing you have in your left hand. Um, and then the only kind of weird part was that diminished walk up. All right, guys, so that'll wrap this video up. Thank you so much for joining me for this video. And like I said, I got a lot more videos coming down the pipeline. Um, uh, I, I do talk a lot in numbers, and so I'm wondering if um, you guys would like a video just on the number system and how that works and uh, just kind of a, a explanation of what exactly do you play on each number. So I had an idea for that video. If you think that would be a good video for this uh, channel or for you that would help you or your musicians, band, whatever, comment below and let me know, and I would love to, to make a video for that, guys. And I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Thank you for joining me. Make sure to like and subscribe and share this video. See you next time.